Today we're here in Pigeon Forge at the Rod Run. Yes, so today's Wednesday and we're gonna take a look at, well, some of the rods that are already here. You ready? I'm ready. Let's do Let's this. Do it. There were so many folks crowding this last time, we didn't get a chance to take an in-depth look. This here is the North Carolina, well, prison bus, actually, yes. And it has its, uh, its ball and chain. <laughs> but we're gonna take a look on the inside here and see what it's about. As you can see, there's, uh, there's some old seats. It's actually a bus. We got some handcuffs on the ceiling there, and I guess that's why they call it riding shotgun. Of course, there's a <laughs> there's a shotgun in here, and um, yes, watch your head. But this is here every single year, and it's always parked out in front of Island Drive Lodge. Take a look at this uh, monstrous blowing engine here. Here's a souped up fire truck, yes! It's even got a Dalmatian riding shotgun, as they would say. They definitely know how to put out fires here in, well, North Carolina. And definitely got a monster, monster engine in there. Well, here's a 41 Ford called Father and Son. This is a 1971 Camaro. Oh, she is, she is definitely, definitely a sweet one. Pretty, really pretty. 
It says it's got a, a 396 in her. I, I like that silver and that black. There's a whole bunch of old Chevys. You got that Chevy Nova over there. Kind of got that midnight blue or going on. It says it's got a 502 in her. Wow, that would definitely scream. Of course, you got this SS Camaro here. I think this here is what this is probably a 69. 69 Camaro here. And then you have this old Super Sport. I think this is a Chevelle. Yeah, it's a Chevelle. Oh, right here, it's a 60, a 66 Chevelle. Won 40,000 for her. Check out this 1970 Nova. It says it's got a 454 in it. Me and Trump are driving down the Pigeon Forge Road run together. A 29 Ford Pick'em Up Roadster. Here's a 66 Belvedere that's been definitely, well, modded in Pro Street. Pretty, pretty, pretty blue. As you can see inside, she's got you know, the full, it's like a five point harness there. It's got all of its field cutoff switches and Definitely a, a racer for sure. Got some some big old meats back here. She's a pretty one. Here's the inside of that Eleanor uh, Shelby. <laughs> the old Shelby symbol on the dash there and definitely Definitely really cool. Just a random three-wheeler. Well, here's a sharp looking little rat rod here. Definitely looking good, especially with them, them white wall tires. Really definitely sets it off. Get the old, big old power plant there. Power this slammed almost all the way down on the ground there. Definitely love its uh, rusty finished uh, paint or what have you on that. <laughs> A lot of folks don't always like rat rods, but they're they're definitely getting more popular. I see it's got a Ron John Surf Shop. Yes, you gotta have a Ron John Surf Shop sticker. She's a she's a beauty. Got a fuel cell here in the back, and she's a looking good, looking good. They only want ten thousand for her here. This '71 GMC is back again this year. I remember that from past rod runs. I'm loving this 1957 Chevy, guys. It's got this really cool uh, gold, I guess you call it a gold color. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Sits pretty. I uh, love the interior. You got to check out the interior in this. It's kind of like got a, a golden color with this black. Yeah. It says it's for sale. It's one of a kind. It says, look underneath. I definitely believe it's, it's she's, a, she's a straight one. Same owner for over 40 years. What is this? It's like a, it's like a minivan, you get it? It's a, it's a minivan. <laughs> You're gonna show us the inside real quick here. It's an oh, wow. Uh, microwave, air conditioner. I got a fog machine that rolls smoke out my side pipe. Oh, yeah. Got a shower that hangs oh, wow. on the back of it. So you can black lights, TV. You can almost go cross country in this. Oh, yeah. Everything but a toilet. <laughs> oh, oh wow. wow, that is that is cool. <laughs> Pretty much. Well, thank you for showing us. 
That is definitely a short bus. <laughs> Here's a sweet 55 Bel Air. I love that burgundy color. Of course, those, those mag rims here. Take a closer look at the the engine there. Oh wow, she looks she looks good. Yes. It's actually for sale. 49.9. You got this old international here. I don't know, just something about it. She slammed all the way and down on the ground, but Green No Farm. 1937. This is a really cherry 1940 Ford. Wow. They want 39.5 for it. But look at the detail that is in this one. It's absolutely beautiful. I definitely like those white wall tires and them them chromed out hubs there. Check out the deep black in there. Just beautiful all the way around. Let's see the air. Looks like the interior might be a little updated. Of course, got that classic style dash there. They just don't make them like that anymore. She's a absolutely beautiful. Nice little cruiser on a Saturday night. Here's a little Chevy love truck. You definitely don't see these guys anymore. This one here is called Tough Love. Yes, I would say owning one of these would be you know, tough love. I love these old El Caminos with their, their fins. Looks like they can fly away. Check out this Silverado. But what's really unique is it's got one of those LSX motors or LS motors in it. Look at that. So here we are back in the studio. We're back in the studio, guys. From the Pigeon Forge Rod Run. Yeah, so what we did is we walked the strip. Uh, it's Wednesday. It's the Wednesday before. And we noticed that the, it's a little bit lean than previous years. I think this is our fourth year um, doing rod runs. So a little bit lean than previous years. Which I don't know if is an indication that the Friday and Saturday night will probably be a little bit less than normal. I still think it's going to be busy, but I don't think it's going to be like a normal uh, busy rod run. Now we did notice that they're setting up at the LeConte Center and they were bringing the cars into LeConte Center. So that's good. They're going to have a car show at LeConte Center and they had all the vendors out outside you know summit and and what have you so uh we noticed there were some really cool cars uh a little bit of different cars from the shades of the past weekend which was the weekend before um so we're super excited guys we got about three more maybe four more videos of the rod run coming up we're going to give you uh friday and saturday and um probably friday night or saturday night of the rod run coming up and if you guys like this vlog give it a, give thumbs, it a thumbs up, thumbs up. Also, please subscribe so you don't miss these upcoming Well Smoky Mountain Adventures. Uh, we do everything from uh, food reviews, hotel reviews, uh, we do Dollywood, we hike the Smokies, and we bring rod runs and Volkswagens and, 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 and Corvette conventions and everything else. And until next time. Thanks for watching. Bye, everyone. Bye, everybody.